Welcome back, everybody, to your favorite channel and mine, Let's Talk About Sleep. Here is the book that it's based on, book number two coming along the way. Um, the link to this is in the description box down below. These videos are for educational purposes only. If you have any questions, if you have any comments, drop them down in the comment section below. Once a month, I will do a video answering any and all uh, questions. Okay, so... Um, with that being said, let's get to today's topic, which is kind of an interesting one and something that people would talk about a lot, but um, you know, there's not a lot of data out there, but there is some data. So what happens on a full moon, right? Does the lunar cycle really impact sleep and behavior and things of that nature? Because this channel is for sleep, I'm gonna talk about the literature or some of the papers that are out there, or one paper in particular that's on this topic. Now. Anything that affects sleep can also affect behavior. So if we extrapolate that out, chances are, based on what I'm going to tell you, that yes, lunar cycles actually can affect behavior, which is why people have said anecdotally, if there's a full moon tonight, people are acting a little bit nuttier. And uh, I can tell you that probably is the truth, um, living in Manhattan. But, uh, but let's talk about the literature. So, so that what, what this um, group of researchers did, and this is actually about 10 years ago now, uh, they took they took a bunch of patients or subjects, and they put them in pretty stringent lab conditions where the patients were not able to see what the phase of the moon was, right? Whether it was uh, what, what do they call it, waxing or waning, you know, waxing or waning or uh, full moon, you know, whatever the cycle was, they they weren't aware of it. But in the lab setting, they were monitor, monitoring their sleep with a whole bunch of electrodes, right? They were doing a sleep test every night. They were also measuring through blood work, melatonin, cortisol levels, okay? So they were getting a good sense, objectively now, of what was happening to these patients when they slept, okay? And again, the patients were not aware of what phase the moon was. So what the researchers found was on the nights when the lunar cycle was at its peak, you know, there's a full moon, melatonin levels went down and the person's sleep became more disrupted slash less quality, right? So if you know some from some of my other videos, one of the measures of good quality sleep is this thing called N3, non-REM stage three, otherwise known as delta wave sleep. And they found that that was decreased on the nights of the full moon as was endogenous or self-production of melatonin, okay? What does that translate to? Well, these patients were not sleeping as well. Now you can say, well, they were sleeping in a sleep center, how is that? You know how is that uh, applicable to real life because they were already in the lab for several nights leading up to it so that whole notion of being there the first night and and that disrupting their sleep was kind of taken out of the out of the context so this was a pretty interesting and and um, well done study showing that sleep phase does I mean a uh, moon phase does affect sleep now you know this was a small sample size and it was done 10 years ago um, you know, how, how much does that, you know, carry over into the population at large? Hard to say. However, this is objective proof that, that the moon does affect our, our sleep. So if the moon affects our sleep, like I said, that can affect behavior and, you know, we all know what that, what that means, right? Actually, the whole idea of lunacy, right, actually means, comes from lunar phase, right, the lunar cycle and, uh, you know, lunacy, if lunatics that kind of thing, right? So there was this whole old wives' tale that on full moons people people get crazy, and uh, I can't comment on that, but I can comment on their sleep. So take that for what it's worth. You should have good sleep habits anyway, but especially on a full moon, make sure you're doing the right stuff. All right. So please leave comments, questions about this topic or any topic in the comment section down below. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, please click like and please share with your friends and family and please subscribe. Until next time, sleep well.